this video, we're going to have a look at how we can assign item charges to posted purchase documents. If we have a value that we need to assign that isn't an item, such as a freight cost or a labor charge, this is how we can do that after we've already posted our invoice. So to begin, I'll create a new purchase invoice. Select new from the ribbon. We'll enter our vendor name, Fabricam for this one, and the vendor invoice number. This will be whatever number we are provided from our vendor. Next, from our list of types, I'll select item charge. And for this presentation, we'll use freight charge. Our quantity will usually be one. And in this case, to make it a nice easy number, we'll say that signing £1,000. In order to proceed with assigning our item charge, we need to go to line, related information, and item charge assignment. So go to item charge, get receipt lines. And this brings up a list of all our document numbers. In this case, we'll choose a few. Now we've got one quantity to assign of our total amount of a thousand. We need to assign this across all our lines here. We can either do this manually and go to item charge, suggest item charge assignment. Go back from a list of options. We can either assign this equally over all the lines by the amount of each line, by the weight, and by the volume. In this case, we'll assign it equally. So our quantity to us sign in each line is 0.2 of our amount up to assign 200. Now we can close this and post our invoice.